Oh hi there big boys, welcome to Paradox Soul, this is a metroidvania shooter thing which sounds like it's right up my street because I like metroidvanias and I like shooters however it's got quite bad reviews from what I've seen but hopefully it will actually be better than I expected that'd be nice wouldn't it oh, how do we, okay it's up to go down upstairs, oh, oh my god, okay that's bad, this game's about two hours long which is quite short, again up my street so interesting Let's go down here instead of going down there then. I quite like it when games do that. It's like teaching you, don't go that way because you literally die. Don't know why I say it like that, but yeah. Next area. Hopefully we get a gun at some point. Do -do 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 -do. Let's ignore that. Oh, no. Okay, we might ignore that. Movement feels a little bit janky. Doesn't feel the best, to be honest. Yeah, it doesn't, doesn't feel that great. Must be a way to unlock this. Probably, yeah. What have we got? Oh, we got ourselves a key card. Okay, cool. Let's go back to key card lock door okay and we've got ourselves a gun all right here we go let's give this a go also the game does not support achievements which unfortunately is not up my street which is yeah sad to see that that's fine probably just one of those things isn't it one of those things okay let's go Ooh, you die quite easily and by quite easily I mean literally one hit which is um, a negative. Yeah, it's, movement just doesn't feel all that good, honestly. I don't really like how it looks like your gun's holding, like, like you're going to shoot in the air. You know, I, I realise it's because she's like holding it like, um... Oh. What? Is there even any way to see their bullets? I don't think there is. Okay, well, I'm going to get the dog to just walk away from. That's fine. I don't see how what you're supposed to do for that one, though. I should just then go back up again, or, or maybe like walk away. I don't think it's shooting. No, it's not. Okay, I think he can see the bullets. It's really slow. Mm. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. The shooting feels bad. Well, at least it's not great. The design of it—it's kind of annoying. Okay, I was definitely sitting down. Can I not shoot whilst down? No, you can. Yeah. So, what's the problem there then? Oh, I can also slide, apparently. Can I slide and shoot? Alright, oh, I think balls pressing circle puts you in cover, I think. Is that what it's trying to, to tell me? I think. Let's try that again. Okay, come on. I think it did. I think I went into cover there. Alright, this game is not explaining itself very well. Nor is it particularly great, honestly. I don't like how when you get into cover, getting back up again is kind of annoying. It, doesn't, it feels quite sticky. Okay, yes. Yeah, so you get behind cover. There you go. Alright, that's kind of fun. Cool, we did it. Look at me. Aren't I clever? That was really annoying to do and it shouldn't have been that hard. But what's in here then? Is that just back to where we came? Alright, oh, no, this is a... Looks to be a secret, but we don't know how to get up there yet. Okay. Guess we'll come back once we know the skills. You found double jump. Oh no, map. Yay. Oh, uh, how do I access the map then? Oh, L2. Oh my god. Is that the map? That is terrible. Like, what is even going on there? Okay, so I'm at. I think I'm at. Am I at AO5? I think. You can still jump whilst the map's up. You also still move while the map's up. Okay. So we, can we go back in here then and see if there's anything we could do now? Or is it just a... Uh, no. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, this game, I'm not really feeling it uh, at all, to be honest. It's a shame, because I like the idea. And it actually didn't... didn't Like, at first I was like, this could be quite fun. But, oh, no. Oh, no. But, yeah, as I say, it's just... It seems kind of annoying. doesn't feel particularly polished. I just don't really have a desire to play much more of this, which is a shame, because as I say, I, it's a good idea. Um, but no, it's not happening. But maybe I'll, I don't know. We'll, we'll see if it wins me over in, over the next uh, sort of five minutes or so. So I can go back and kill him now. Oh, God, that was close. Okay. I mean, I seriously don't see this, understand this map, though. It's a terrible map. Anyway, that's fine. So we're here now. Ah! You instantly die. I don't like how you instantly die as well. I mean, at least it saves with each room, I suppose. It could be worse, but... Yeah, alright. So it's best to just run away, I think, in that case. 
Can they walk down? No, they can't. Okay, cool. Should I go over here? Oh, watch out. Okay, I guess we'll go back in here, probably get a double jump thing. I think it's best to just ignore the enemies. You don't get anything for doing them. Uh, for killing them. Not doing them. But they do take out your part of your day. But I suppose if you have to shoot them like this, then, you know. And also, the fact they don't move is a bit weird. I don't know. It's just. Uh, it's kind of not that fun. I feel like they just put the one. The one death thing as a way to, like, prolong the game. Okay, if it's only two hours long, you know, then, like, making it so you dial the time is going to make the game last longer. Oh, you're joking! Ah, uh, Yeah, I really don't like this game. It's a shame, though. It is a shame, honestly, because I do like the idea. It's just not quite there. I, and I don't think the game's had an update in a long, long time, so can't see it suddenly being fixed now. If they just made it so there was made it so you didn't immediately down here, lower the health in these guys, cause it takes forever. Improve the controls a bit, so it just doesn't feel as janky to play. So at least when you get into cover, it automatically gets you into cover. That's quite nice. Like when you press circle, that's something. But, um, yeah. Yeah. Can you kill him from here? No. There you go. Alright, good. Now what's in here? Sort of like who wants to be the guy. Is that what it's called? No, don't want to be the guy. That game where it's like really annoyingly hard. It feels a bit like that. But yeah, I mean, I'm all for learning from your mistakes and all that. It's fine, but... When the map design's also this boring, <laughs> Oh! We've got armor. Am I gonna like, take more than one hit now? Probably not. Double jump and air slide. Okay, let's have a look at this. Oh yeah, sort of more full thing. That's cool, okay. I'm glad to get a bit more better movement going on here. It helps you get around the map a bit. But yeah, as I say, it's really hard to know where you are as well, because the map is just terrible. And that's a pretty big complaint in my book. Because you don't want Really? Anyway, yeah, you don't want to be lost in a... Well, I mean, you do want to be lost a bit in these sort of games, but you want to be able to, like, recognise areas. Whereas, I feel like, honestly, in this game, I could not even remotely recognise any of this place. Because all oh, is the same. I don't know if it's going to change at some point, but I doubt it. It's only two hours long. Don't see a way of getting in here, either. No, I mean, obviously, now I'll be like, oh, let's go back and see what we missed. But now I'm like, well... I don't even know because it's the map so confusing. I mean, the most of these games they sort of tell you a um. That's a bit weird how it goes in front uh, over the top of it and doesn't really fit. Ah, oh, my god. Okay, he's not big enough to go in here. Lol. Anyway, yeah, I don't like these games when you don't know where to go and like when the map sort of tell you, oh, you've not been to this area. It's like, oh, maybe I should go back and check. I'll oh, see the enemies are respawning now. Of course they are. Maybe I get a better gun at some point. Yeah, I mean, I suppose if it's only two hours long, maybe I might play for it, because it isn't terrible. It isn't terrible. Um, and, as I say, I feel like there might be some some gold in here, hidden away. Pretty sure there was an area we could, um, I don't know where it was, but I'm pretty sure there was an area where we could jump, yeah, like that. Oh, you can also climb up walls and stuff, apparently, okay. Kill that man whilst we're here. If he's too far away from them, then they basically can't do anything. Okay, let's go over here. There you go. I think I could make that jump originally, but now I can. Great. We're in another area that looks exactly the same. Oh, and I fell down. That's silly of me, wasn't it? Oh, and I died instantly. That's also very silly of me. Okay. We'll try and get to this next area then and see what we uh, what we think. If there's anything exciting. Is there going to be another area that looks exactly the same? Oh, it is, yeah. Um, okay. Just ignore these guys. Um, no... No, nothing up there. Go in here. That's all. Oh, boss fight time. Okay, this might be something fun to end the video on. Let's do it. How am I going to aim up? I can't aim up higher, so surely it's going to be just me doing this. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, at least the movement feels a lot better now that I've got this uh, upgrade, which I guess kind of makes sense, to be fair. Dodging still feels dodgy. Haha. <laughs> but, uh, oh my god! Okay, that was a new thing I didn't expect there. Anyway, I think we're going to end the video here. Not terrible, not terrible. Not for me, though. I think it's a cool idea. I just think that it's flawed in the fact that you die instantly if any hit. And the just doesn't, you know, just the combat doesn't feel that great. Movement doesn't feel all that great. It feels better than the combat does. But, um, yeah, I don't know. It's not for me, I think. But at least the, the maps all look the same as well. I have a no-no for me in Metroidvania's. 
yeah, I mean, the pixel art's decent enough, at least. Um, um, it's not terrible. It isn't terrible. I, um, sorry, I wasn't paying attention to why I was doing so badly. But, yeah, I don't think I particularly want to play any more of this game ever, really. Which is a shame. It's a shame. Plus, I didn't spoil achievements, which is uh, always a sad thing. We'll try and get to this next phase, at least. There you go. I mean, it's not the hardest of boss, I don't think. He takes a lot of hits, though. But I suppose he is a boss, so. He my boss, uh. Okay, look, well, let's try and beat it. Because I, I would like to beat it just for my own sort of um, uh, sense of self. Okay, so now we do the same thing. I get up. See? I just... The one hit annoys me. Anyway, right. That was a game. That was Paradox uh, Soul. Thanks for watching, big boys. It's important to... Oh, okay, you can jump over them. Actually, maybe it's a better idea just to jump over them. I mean, probably not, but it's cool that you can do that at least. Woohoo! Oh! I didn't... Why does it rush me into that? Anyway, yeah, that was a game. So that's watching Big Book Boys since point in time. And bye!